Hey guys, and welcome back to Frontlines. Let's continue, shall we? Coalition Combined Arms Forces are now gathered near the Southern Russian Command Facility. Reports of nuclear capabilities within, as well as high-ranking Red Star Commanders. Assault the facility, first wave to be led by tank and helicopter attack uh, upon exterior. Interior infantry incursion to follow. Yeah, this mission's a bit rough. Yes, I understand, sir, but we'll need an additional two to three rounds of airstrikes. High altitude this time. We barely scratched. Not gonna happen. You're gonna have to take it by foot. Yes, sir. You hang in there, Sergeant. Of course, sir. They've got an ICBM in there with a huge nuclear warhead. We have no choice but to go in and get it. So get to the tanks. Command will brief you momentarily. Get to the tanks? Get to the tanks, he says. We're gonna go to the helicopter. Dude. We get one shot using this helicopter. Welcome to Red Star Southern Russian Command. Remember General Votikov, the Red Star General who nuked you in Kazakhstan? He's holed up inside the old Soviet base. Oh, is he now? Bit of payback then. So our old friend that nuked us is holed up here. Interesting. So this helicopter has rocket pods, which. Mm, make short work of these guys we also can switch positions in this helicopter and have like a it's kind of like a meaty 20 millimeter machine gun or something now it sounds cool the only trouble with it is we need to get out of the pilot seat to use it now if we do that well you better believe we're going to be falling um pretty far <laughs> so we're not going to be using the 20 mil this is kind of a shame because it slaps Never mind. Anyway, we're going to let our rocket pods do the talking here. As you can see, uh, we don't get a lot of ammo, unfortunately, with the uh, helicopter. Ooh, nasty. That's okay. So, what should we do next? I think the best thing to do would be to try and thin out as much as we can whilst we're here. Got some artillery. Can waste that. Really don't want them to be bothering us with this. We have some normal kind of like anti-armor missiles as well, which is always nice to use. Let's see what else. There should be another artillery piece down here. And these artillery pieces really aren't much of a threat, but when in Rome. Cool. Nice shooting. Well, I mean, everything's easy when you're in a helicopter and you can basically wipe everything out with one go. You would have thought there'd be some level of anti-aircraft coming at us, but apart from unguided rockets, there really ain't much going on down there. Pity, I know. What a terrible pity. I'm going to keep taking out as many of these guys. Um, it's just such a shame that this is all you get with the helicopter. I mean, I guess maybe online you could... Um, there was more stuff you could do. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My bad. My bad. We are proceeding with the objective, boss. Luckily... Ah, oh, damn it, we're already out of uh, missiles. Right, I'm full. Wow, the small arms are just not doing any damage to us at all. It's kind of interesting. Tag as many of these troops as possible, because you better believe there's a lot of them in here. Kind of crazy, actually. Right, let's reload our last pack of ammo. Where are those missiles coming from? They're kind of coming from everywhere, really. Well, every soldier we kill here is one less to deal with when one first. As I said, this mission is pretty spicy. We're receiving repairs. I don't think we could, there's anywhere we can go to rearm either. Which sucks. I mean, you know, 
been literally on the front lines here, so it makes sense, but it would have been would have been nice if there was somewhere we could fall back to. Ooh, well there's a target rich environment. Yeah, we've always got work to do. Ah, uh, we killed the last one. So that means we're literally out of ammo. I wonder, you know. I wonder. If we land back. Oh, there isn't a helipad, is there? Was there no helipad that we... Ah, wait. I wonder if there is a way of rearming. There was a helipad back here. You know, I've never been back to this base before. <gasps> Wait. Oh, we can rearm. The hell? That's pretty freaking cool. Yeah, so if we switch to... Our other seat, we've got this pretty badass Gatling gun. But... Yeah, we can't use it. <laughs> Which is so incredibly lame. But then I suppose they do give you these rocket pods. And they give you, um, you know, these uh, anti-armor missiles. Probably didn't have to give us two types of missiles, to be honest. Alright, how are we doing? I'm hoping our guys can actually get in here. and take this point, but I'm going to go out on a limb and say actually they can't. Let's right, thin the herd as much as we can. What we could possibly do, although I'm not sure how effective this is going to be, sit here and take this area. Hopefully our helicopter's not going to be destroyed. Cool. Alright, there's one. Don't you worry about the tower. We're on it. Whoa! These missiles do feel good to use. They feel crazy powerful. Let's try and thread the needle. Kind of, I guess. Well, you know, do you even need the Gatling gun, to be fair, with how OP... Oh, God, we're reloading. Ooh, you can also apparently slice enemies with the rotors, which I did not know about. But I am very happy to know that that is an ability we have. Oh, God, those rockets are so devastating. Now, ooh, that was naughty. That was very naughty. Let's see if we can just slide in here, shall we? Oh, these guys down here are kind of doing a little bit too much damage. Right, let's back off. We need some repairs. <coughs> we. Desperately need some repairs. And I desperately need coffee. Decided to use powdered milk. That was a mistake. That was a big mistake. Whoa. Almost clipped us with that. So I guess we can rearm as many times as we want. Receiving ammunition. Come hey on. Let's use all of that. So we have to reload. And go back out. Oh, we do now have somebody. Apparently. On board. Now, is he going to use the Gatling gun? Maybe. Now, I wonder. If I switch seats. Yep. If I switch seats, we just literally fall out of the sky. Because the AI won't even keep you in, in the air. Which is a little bit on the pants side, but hey, what can you do? Dickhead with a rocket launcher. He was the one causing us all the problems. 
would really have liked the ability to um, destroy these. Would have been cool, but whatever. Can't all have what we want, can we? Now, how are we looking? We're looking fine. Now, can we drop this thing down somewhere where we can get back in it? Possibly. Possibly. It kind of, hey, does anybody remember the Action Man helicopter, which kind of looked like a Comanche? Um, that's what this helicopter reminds me of. It's kind of like the Action Man helicopter. Kind of, I guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're on it. We're on it. Yep, I guess the guy on the machine gun is actually doing stuff. Which is cool. I mean, I don't really know what he's doing, but he's doing stuff. So. Unfortunately, it looks like our guys can't actually... Um, do anything about the objectives, which sucks. That's okay. We'll thin the numbers out and then we'll go in ourselves. Cool. We'll leave the chopper up here. As long as it doesn't get taken out, we can always grab it again. Right, now you'll notice we're actually playing as a different class here. We like the Spec Ops. The Spec Ops is cool. This SMG is actually not too bad. It has a incredible rate of fire, as you can see. Not too much else going for it. And it, for what it is, it's quite accurate as well. Right, let's go grab the U. That'll do, Donker. That'll do. Alright, now, where is my helicopter? Good. Still here. Always a little bit sketch. Never know. Oh, hello. Yeah. Good night. Dude on the gun. Please use the gun. I mean, you know, if you want. Don't feel like you have to or anything. Yeah. God, that gun does crazy damage when it hits. Kind of feels like playing a strike game or something. Almost. Like a modern one. How cool would that have been? I don't actually know if we can destroy this radar. I'm going to say probably not. Unfortunately. Come on, get those weapons reloaded. There we go. Much better. Oh, the humanity. Oh, the humanity. He threw superior firepower. Guy on the gun is just a champion. Yeah, we are... Ooh. Really rocked us there. Yeah, see, this is interesting. I literally thought we had this thing for 30 seconds until we run out of ammo, and then that's it. It's all over. But no, I guess not. Guy on the machine gun just going ham on these guys. Which is exactly what we want. Right, let's dump her down. Because this pilot has to do all the demolitions as well. I love the way this helicopter, like, folds up and unfolds its wings. It's really, really cool. Such a cool um, futuristic helicopter design. I don't know how practical it would be, but that's not for me to decide, I guess. Right, let's loop this. Boop. We'll grab our chopper back. <laughs> I mean, that's quite a complex little system. Having the, uh... Enemy Air Force? Did we say Air Force or Ambush? Right, 
Right, let's go get some more weapons. Oh, our dude that was with us has apparently disappeared. That sucks. He didn't actually do too bad on that gun. What do you mean, return to the field of battle? We are in the field of battle. Oh no, that's how they do you? Oh, that's lame. So yeah, okay. Apparently you're not allowed to use the helicopter anymore or something. Like when you get to a certain point. That's really lame. Like, w come on. They give you this helicopter and... They don't really let you enjoy it as much as you should be able to. Never mind. I guess it would probably be too easy otherwise. Alright, let's just drop down. Oh, nope, she's gone. Well, I would like to say we got our money's worth out of it, but I mean, not really. Ow, 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 ow. Oof. Okay, so apparently now we're in the Russian tank and we also have a limit on our coaxial machine gun. But we didn't earlier, did we? We didn't in our, um, the first time we got into one of these things. So bizarre. Well, whatever, I guess. Now, I don't think we can get through here. Doesn't look like it. Sad face. Okay, um, we're about to lose the tank anyway, unless we, yep, we're losing it. Oh god, and we have no equipment whatsoever. Well, that's okay. That is pretty rough actually. Right, we need some heavy firepower. Luckily a tank has just dropped into existence over here, but <laughs> that doesn't matter. Uh, change equipment. Oh, we can be a sniper here. But you know what? Let's just go assault. Uh, is there a rocket launcher about here, guys? I mean, usually... Usually there are rocket launchers, like, everywhere. It's like one of the main weapons that you can always pick up. To the point where it actually makes... Whoa! Jeez. The hell? They got artillery. I mean, I guess they've got artillery. Dude, that was savage. Yeah, so to the point where essentially using um, the anti-vehicle class is kind of pointless because there's just literally rocket launchers everywhere. And it's not really worth the trade-off, either, of having a terrible, terrible um, weapon loadout. Because the rocket launcher is never that good against infantry, as it is when the enemy uses it. Let's see. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Ow. I guess there is some kind of artillery dropping on us. Something's going on anyway. Weird. Nothing good up here anyway. Alright, well, whatever. Let's stop fucking around and actually try and do some damage. If we can. Jamie can't jump over this. Oh, we can jump over this wall. Good. Let's go grab one of these Red Star tanks as well whilst we're at it. You know, for good measure. Ooh. Oh, they are. Batteries. Kind of look like it might be batteries. Uh, now, is there anything around? Sniper rifles? Nope. Right, anybody want to jump in? Anyone? Oh, we've got someone in. Excellent. D Morgan. Alright. Welcome aboard, D Morgan. Let's go fuck some shit up. Come on, sir. There's fuckery to spread. Nice. Now let's just wait whilst my coaxial machine gun 
reloads painfully slowly. Now we can't destroy tank traps, sadly. Yeah. Such a shame. We do have the ability to call in a gunship, which is cute. Ooh, there it is. I thought you were still here. Well, no matter. Oh! You know what? We could use that, but... We could also just blast it. You know. Come on. Let's see that little helmet of yours pop off. Do us all a solid, sir. Ooh. We're trying. Just keep pushing that objective. Really? They're behind us? Another one that's late for work, guys. Well, that's kind of an unfortunate situation to be in. Ooh. Hopefully, we can find some stuff in here that we can use. Saying that, we, we can call in a uh, Griffin airstrike. Which is kind of like an AC-130, so it's plenty powerful. I was going to say, I know there's a sniper here somewhere. Oof. Not really a fan of how the Griffin gunship works. It's You, you kind of got to keep lasering the targets, and it just, like, uses extreme damage. But I don't think... You really know when it's going to run out. See, like, if we use it here. There we go. And it just, it doesn't seem... Oh. And there's a sniper rifle there, apparently. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be super effective. Or as effective as you'd like it to be. So where the hell are we now? Alright, we've got three deployments left, if I can speak properly. Yeah, we definitely want that sniper rifle. Apparently, we still have some gunship left. So, yeah, that just eventually runs out. You don't get that much with it either. What are you doing? You're standing there. Can you not just accept your defeat like a man and move on? I guess, I guess not. Right, let's go grab ourselves that rifle. Because I get the feeling a sniper rifle is going to be something that we really want. Ah! Gimme, 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 gimme! Yes! Right, now let's just check. Oh, enemy infantry. That it, damn it. That is a job for Sniper Joe. As long as there's no Sniper Ivans around, we should be okay. Let's <laughs> see his beret just like fly off into the distance. You have to love it. Well, that's not exactly his Sniper Rifle, Ivan. And I suppose RIP our knees as well, but knees are optional. I'm sure in this great year we can uh, get some kind of cool artificial ones or something. Alright. Nice. Let's take it. Oof, I think this is going to be another two-part mission. Just because um, assaulting that thing inside is pretty chaotic. Who is shooting you, sir? You're making enough noise to wake the dead. Honestly, no one's got any manners around here. Yep. Yeah, you would have thought they wouldn't have left the power station outside, but I mean, hey, what do I know about constructing forts? Nothing, apparently. Especially if the power station can be just like taken out by a airstrike. Oof. It's getting pretty hectic in there. 
Oh, we're good. They're not good. Wow, he literally just took a thousand rounds in his ass cheeks. And just laughed it off. Oof. Oof. Okay. Let's take over the motor pool. Damn it. Why do they, why are they allowed heavy machine guns and we're not? Not fair. Not fair. So we're pretty light on gear when we go back in here, because this will be the second part. Yep. Drones? The drones? Man thinks we got drones. Use your drones to help you. Well, that would be a great idea, Commander Jackass. Well, I guess there's a drone here, actually. So, maybe I should shut my mouth. Okay. See, where were these toys when I was a kid? We never had anything like this. We just had rather generic toys. Whoa, jeez, dude. Damn. Well, I mean, we got some use out of it, I suppose. Let's try that again. A little bit less failure this time. These bloody gun turrets here. Kind of rough. Drones, he says. Plural. Of course we can take these guys. Just might require a life or two. Or at least oof, lots of patience. Now if you guys would actually advance and do some damage, this would be a little bit quicker. Think we hit them? I hit one of them. There we go. He's gone. Now, these little turrets are kind of spicy, but no match for the 40 mil grenades. Excellent. Right, let's go, guys. One last little ditch effort. Stop us from breaching. Well, no luck, sir. Oh, wait, hang on. Maybe there is still some luck. One on the other side. Yep. They like their symmetry. Sweet. Ugh, that was a bit hectic now, wasn't it? I guess we could. There's just... As you can see, there's no gear here, but there will be. Oof, that was a tough nut to crack. Yeah, we lost about 80% of our manpower, but it's fine. It's like a vault in Fallout. Vault 69, here we go. Mountain King. Right, I'm going to leave it here, guys, because this bit can get quite spicy. So, we'll uh, finish this one off in the next video. So, thank you very much for watching, guys, and as always, till next time.